Hello, this is just a short video showing Adobe After Effects CC performance on a Quadro K6000. This is a rendering test that you can download uh, using the link in the description. Let's start the rendering. Here you have the download link. I am using uh, After Effect uh, CC. Uh, the original uh, uh, download is for uh, After Effect CS6 but the benchmark will work exactly the same way. You just have to start the rendering. The K6000 has uh, a boost frequency of 902 MHz and as you can see the card is now at 901 megahertz so it is on its post frequency the card is uh, not very loud the fan speed is always above 50 percent uh, Nvidia describes this uh, VGA as the most powerful pro graphic on planet built for tackling the largest visual performances. It has 12 gigabytes of onboard memory. Uh, this VGA is to be a pro VGA requires a lot of power. You will need two 6-pin connectors from your power supply. This benchmark stresses quite a lot the GPU. As you can see we are running at a GPU temperature of 72 degrees Celsius. Uh, usually during the benchmark the card will reach almost 80 degrees and what I noticed is that the uh, this card is set to uh, increase the fan speed only if the temperature will go above 80 degrees. Right now room temperature is uh, 20 degrees and the computer is water cooled so only the GPU is really generating it. Video capturing seems to consume some computational resources. In fact, I was able to complete this test with the K6000 without the video capturing uh, in uh, 3 minutes and 3 seconds from for the uh, rendering part. Okay, as you can see, we almost reach 80 degrees and the fan speed is at 46 percent. Not very loud, you really can't hear it, uh, hear the VGA at all, also if you are very close to your computer. It would be nice to have the possibility to increase fan speed to lower the temperature, but I was not ab able to do that. Okay, so we completed the test in 3 minutes 27 seconds and then a couple of seconds here and there thanks for watching let me know if you have any question